Hi, you guys. Welcome back. And of course, if you're new to this channel, welcome. My name is Tracy Erickson, and this is your general tarot reading for fire signs for August 2021. So that just means that if you are Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, then this is your general tarot reading for August 2021. And the main idea here is base chakra. So with base chakra being the main theme of this reading, you guys, I show that the month of August is going to be all about setting up your foundation. Um, it's about securing yourself. It's about um, creating just that firm foundation that you can build the rest of your life upon. Because the root chakra is all about security. It's all about survival. So it could have a lot to do with your physical reality. So where you live or your finances. This card being your theme is all about you securing yourself for your future. Over here we have temptation along with authority. All right. So with the temptation card here showing up next to the authority card, I feel like Honestly, in this entire situation, you may not have really been connecting too much with your heart. Um, in the past, it may have been more like what you want others to see on the outside or, um, you know what I mean, could have been based on maybe greed or something along those lines with the temptation card showing up. Um, but then we have the authority card. So it's almost like you've gained some kind of inner authority over those inner demons of yours. And so now with this base chakra, it's like due to this maturity you've gained internally, this awareness, because look, he has like a halo of light around his head. So you've gained a new level of awareness here. Um, and it, notice authority is also the number four, which is all about structure, stability. Same thing as the base chakra, really. Um, but anyway... With this authority, you are now ready to, you know, build this firm foundation, kind of start over almost. Okay, then over here, we have intuition next to new beginnings. So you have, you'll be following your intuition um, as you kind of guide yourself through this new beginning that you'll be experiencing in the month of August, you guys. Um, so just make sure as you step into these new beginnings that you really are connecting with your inner self as well. You don't just want to, um, you don't only want to pay attention to your outer world. You need to also pay attention to your inner world. So just keep that in mind, obviously with that intuition card showing up because your intuition is going to tell you so much. All right, fire signs. Let me give these a few shuffles. We're going to get the Rider weight cards to weigh in here and give us a little clarity on this reading for you fire signs. All right, so this is for August 2021 for all of you Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius out there. Just have to remind myself what I'm doing. <laughs> all of you Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius out there. All right, let's see what we got. Okay, so we have the Four of Swords is reversed. Then we have the Empress reversed. We have Six of Swords and we have Page of Pentacles reversed. All right, you guys. So I see this as being like, look at this. Okay, the clarity I'm receiving right now, the message that I'm receiving, the Empress is reversed, right? So whatever you're creating was possibly not completely 100% up to you because the Empress is one who creates for herself. All right, so... This, whatever you're creating here, whatever um, firm foundation you're building for yourself, it's not only involving you and you're not the only creator of it, right? So then we have the four of swords reverse and then we have six of swords upright. So it didn't even take much. Okay, there wasn't a lot of reflection and meditation, but either way, we're moving forward. This is the change. We're going for it. But then we have the page of pentacles reversed and that's kind of showing like there is new, there are new things happening all around you, but it, you might not have even given it much notice. So all kinds of new things going on without much notice. It's more like, 
Life's just changing. Let's go. Um, didn't take time to smell the flowers, if you know what I mean. All right. So maybe take some time. Be reflective. And um, maybe even journal. Oh, wow, you guys. We had a crystal angel card falling out already. And our advice from the crystal angels comes from Dolomite. And it says, stay strong in your faith. A positive outcome is dependent on you keeping a positive mindset. All right, you guys, I'm going to get another one that came out really fast. So I just feel like there's more that these cards want to say. So let's see if there's another card from the crystal angel deck here. Okay, so here we have um, Shara White and it says spiritual protection. You're being watched over and protected physically, emotionally, and energetically. So, throughout all of these life changes and what you're doing here, just remember that you are divinely protected. God, your ascended masters, your, um, you know, your lost loved ones, everyone's here and rooting for you and praying for your success. So you should also do the same. All right. All right, you guys. If you guys like this video, be sure to click that like button and share this video with all your fire sign friends out there. And of course, if you're a viewer but not yet a subscriber, I would love for you to click subscribe down below. And once you have subscribed, you can then click that bell to be notified each and every time I upload a new video. Thank you guys so much for watching and spending your time with me. I love you and I'll see you next time. Bye.